Okay, so, sorry about that. It took me longer to get ready than I thought it would. I was trying to play a game that I remember playing pretty easily in the past. But of course, when I try to play it now, it, it didn't work. At all. I had to download like three emulators and a hundred firmwares to make it work. And now I think it'll work, maybe, possibly? I'm not sure. That was a great time. I love when everything just falls apart. Isn't that the, isn't that the best? Isn't that just great? All right, so let's see. Let me get a game capture up here so we can play the video game. Let's get going. Let's try to make up for lost time. What we got, what we got. Eh, probably. Okay. Let me adjust here so I can actually see. That's much more betterable. And is this gonna, is this gonna work? Yep. Let's transform this to fit to the screen. There we are. Oh boy, that's a little loud. Little bit loud. Turn it down a little. This, why is the emulator pausing when inactive? I don't want that. Okay, here we go. This is Gexo Sentai Car Ranger. It's for the Sufami Turbo which is a funny little um, add-on for the Super Famicom where you could stick two smaller little video games into it because I guess Bandai didn't want to pay Nintendo to make a bunch of video games so they instead made their own video game cartridge that they could put into another video game cartridge and nobody bought it because no one wants to buy an extra video game cartridge to put your video game cartridges in. It's kind of silly, it's kind of dumb, it was kind of a bad idea but here we are. They made a Car Ranger game for it. And since we play Power Rangers on Tuesday, I figured we could play Car Ranger today. That makes sense. I think that fits. Yeah, I think it makes sense to do that. All right, so let's let's see. Do we want to music or do we want to car? Have I ever picked this? M oh, I think that's just mono and stereo. Well, now I know. Now I know. I never knew what it does because I can't reach. I can't read squiggly. Alright, so here we go. It's stage one. We're gonna pick a ranger, and Yoda, baby Yoda's here for the marketing reasons. Um, what color? What color should we be, everyone? Which one? They, they all, as you can see, they can all jack off very quickly. They're very good at it. They're very professional. Very professional hand, hand movers. Pick a color. Somebody pick a color for me. Come on, I know you guys know your colors. Just say one color. Uh, uh, okay, the first one I saw was blue. Uh, we'll do blue. Here we go, okay. So here we are, we're the Blue Ranger. We can jump, we can slide, because we look like Mega Man. It makes sense that the blue one can slide. He's the most Mega man of them all. And we're gonna punch these Squid Boys in the face. And they're gonna fart in our face with their mouths. So, we're the Blue Ranger. Now, in the American show... Oh, I have a sword now. I mean, a gun. So, in the American show... Oh, I'll take that. The Blue Ranger was played by a child. He was a child ranger, which was weird. When he morphed, he turned into a big boy with a big, big boy body, I think. I mean, he looked like a big boy. Um, I, I wonder what happened to his head. Like, when, if he takes off his helmet, does he have a little boy head on a big man body? Like, I, th this was never addressed by the show, and now I'm curious as to, as to what the truth is. What could the truth possibly be? We'll never know. It's actually, the Kid Ranger concept, it was actually a concept they took from, um, a Super Sentai. They took it from Die Ranger, where the White Ranger is uh, also a kid who turns into a big boy. Um, that's why when you see the White Ranger in Power Rangers, you'll notice sometimes he kind of acts like a big baby when he's morphed. That's because he's actually a kid, morphed into a grown man. It's true. You never knew it, now you know. That's a tank. I'm gonna get this and shoot everyone. We got him. Now that wasn't very fair, but what's it matter? Who was the Power Ranger that killed his roommate? Oh, you gotta bring up the sore subjects. I believe that was maybe the red Wild Force Ranger. 
it might have been him. Um, he might have killed his roommate with a sword. Yeah, that might have happened a little bit. N not a great moment in the history of Power Rangers. Or, or human people. Oh, damn it, my, my sword gun. I lost it. it. I mean, if you only kill people a little bit, it's more socially acceptable than killing them a lot of bit. You know, I'm just saying. There, there, there's a limit. There's a hard limit you gotta consider. So we gotta find these gears that are hidden in the stage because our Megazord fell apart and all these gears belong to it. We're gonna need it to put it back together again later. So we gotta make sure we punch all the walls and get hit by all the tires so we can find these damn gears. I don't think there's any here. Yeah, I don't see none. Let's go in this funny door. I'm doing it. Yeah. There's bound to be all sorts of things hidden here. Like... Oh! Oh, you see that? That means we got enough gears to build one of the cars in our Megazord. We did a great job. We got one whole car. If we get at least one car per, per stage, I think we'll be good. I think we should do pretty well. But let's keep going. Here we are. As you can see, we're in the car dump. We're here because we need all these pieces, and where else would you find pieces for a car than in the car dump? That's the health soda. It's it's not very well known, but if you drink soda, it it restore it makes your health go up. In real life, just drink a whole bunch of soda, and I promise you feel much healthier. Much healthier. Oh. Okay, this guy I forgot his name, but I believe he sings songs that can cause cars to to um to fly in the air. He sings songs and it makes the cars want to fly away. I think he's about to do it. See, he's conducting these cars to fly away and attack me. He's very rude. He's a very rude dude. Can't believe he would do such a thing to me. But it's fine, we're just gonna keep punching him in the butt until he stops. Just keep giving him a few butt punches, we'll be fine. We did it. He's on fire. He's dead. Alright, we successfully murdered that man. Here we are. I hope you're proud of me. And there's the car we unlocked! It's red! That's a good color for a car. It's, it's probably great. Alright, um, next, do we want yellow, pink, or green? Which one? Yellow, pink, or green? We're gonna save red for the last level. It, it, as is custom. Green, green was the first color I saw. Here we go. Alright, we're the green boy. Now, the green boy, I don't remember what his ability is. Oh, that's right, the green boy has a Princess Peach jump. As you can see, he can float down just like the princess herself. It's a very useful ability to have. Very useful. If you want to pretend you're a princess. Very... Oh, I just forgot I can't slide, because I'm not blue like Mega Man. I gotta get used to this. I gotta get used to being Princess Peach. There we go. Oh, well that's a waste of... Oh, never mind, we unlocked a bunch of cool shit. Give it to me before it despawns. There we go. Oh, okay. That's fine, just blow up that innocent car. No one needed it. Now, uh, in the American show, the Green Ranger was initially um, Adam, who was the second Black Ranger. Uh, we saw Adam on Tuesday when we were playing Mind Warfare Power Rangers the movie. He died in the train yard. In, in the video game, which is not canon, in, 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 in canon, he did not die. I promise he's still alive. He's real. And I think he went on to voice some characters in, uh... What's it called? The, 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 that, that one anime where, where, where it's all Western. That... Hold on. It's bothering me now. I have to look it up. Okay. Johnny Young Bosch voices. Uh, Johnny Young Bosch. Where is it? Voice acting. Uh, Trigun! Okay, that's what it was. He went on to voice Vash the Stampede in Trigun. That's what he did. I don't know how I forgot- I guess I forgot it because I never saw it. I've never seen Trigun. I'm not a very good anime. So sue me. Sue me, why don't you? But yeah, so Johnny Young Bash, who played Adam, went on to do a whole bunch of anime voices, and you've probably seen them in some of your favorite animes. But I can't tell you what their names are because I'm not very good at watching anime. I'm bad at watching anime. I'm really stinky at watching anime. 
I think I saw Dragon Ball Z. Uh... That's an anime, right? That still counts? Does that count as an anime? Can I be a part of the anime gang, having seen Dragon Ball Z? I hope so. That's all I got. I saw G Gundam. It was similar to Dragon Ball Z, but with robots. That also counts. I don't think Johnny Young Bosch is in it, but it's an anime. Alright, we're doing pretty good. We already have two cars. Oh, that's right! He's, he's, vo he's voicing Broly in, I think, that Dragon Ball Fighter game, I think. I think. So, so basically, we're basically playing as Broly right now. That's what this, this amounts to. That's what this all leads up to. Let's go in this cave. We can't go in the cave, everyone. Don't get your hopes up. But we can drink this health soda. It's very delicious. Oh, no. So this guy, if you couldn't tell, he likes to eat food. I don't know how you'd, you'd know that if you didn't watch the show. Um, but yes, he likes to eat. He's a big eater. And I'm shooting him with my power gun. He had it coming, to be honest. He's kind of being a big old prick with his fork and his knife at the same time. So let's just fill him full of lead. Just go on, fill him right up. It turns out, this is a very good character to fight this boss with. Because forks and knives are no good against guns. If you ever get in a fork and knife fight, just get a gun. I promise you'll do great. Real good. He exploded. So we're very excited about it. This is how our face looks when we're excited. There's the other one. That one's a big old truck. With big old lights on it. Oh boy. Okay. Are we gonna be pink or yellow? Which one? Pink or yellow? Pink. Pink's the first one I saw. We're gonna be the pink one. Here we go. Alright, we have a little headlight here because it's very dark. Pink can double jump. She's very good at it. It, it takes a lot of practice to double jump. It's not something you can just do right off the bat. You have to put a lot of work into it. Otherwise, otherwise you might do the opposite of a double jump, which is not, not jumping at all. Oh no. So these guys are playing Minecraft. They have to get lost. Um, it, hold on, I found this car inside this pot. It was just in there. No one knows how it got there. Thankfully, we can blow the heck out of tanks with our bare fists. Oh, there's nothing else in these pots? Okay. I would have liked to have something else in the pot. If you want to go back and put something else in that pot, I'd appreciate it. How come I don't get a pickaxe? This isn't fair, Notch. Get it together. I'm going in this door. Oh, no. I'm more lost than I've ever been. Oh, I knew that pot looked suspicious. We're going down it like a Mario pipe. Uh, th this doesn't look like what's inside a pot. I've been fooled. Stop carrying that box of death. Put it away. I don't even know what this is supposed to be, but I'm gonna hit it anyway. Yeah, that's right. Get lost. Nice hook to put a, so a sword in. Uh-oh. That poor guy dropped his load. Poor load dropper. Get out of here. Oh. I still don't know what this is. Oh, doesn't matter. We got enough parts for another car. That's all that counts, and now I'm gonna shoot you with my deadly overkill gun. You're dead. Gotcha. Oh, oh I'm not doing too hot. My health's about to rot away. Okay, careful, careful. Care okay. And I found my sword. Oh! Dog, why are you crying? So, my dog was just standing on my bed, then he yelped, and then he ran away. I don't know what's wrong with him. I don't think he likes it when I stream. Nothing could have possibly hurt him. He was standing on my bed. I think he might just be stupid. I think I might have a stupid dog here. He might be a big dummy. But what do I know? Oh, whoa, whoa, you, oh God. Okay, that's fine. We're good. Oh, 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 well, now we're in the pits. I, oh no, I don't, I don't like this at all. We just got plowed to death. Well, we gotta do it again, I think. I don't remember if it sticks you halfway through the stage or at the beginning. Okay, good, it sticks us halfway through the stage. Okay, I, I don't, 
We did real bad here. This is where the game gets hard. Maybe the Pink Ranger isn't good for this stage. There's too many things, like, down on the floor that he- that, that she can't hit very easily. All she can do is double jump. I've not felt the need to double jump even once! Why would I ever want to double jump in this stage? Doesn't matter, we got our car. Alright, here we go. Okay, I guess if we get close enough to that weird, uh, that weird ball spewer, it doesn't hurt at all. So the trick is to, whenever you see a ball spewer, get real close to its ball. It'll be safe, I promise. Nothing bad will ever come from getting close to a ball spewer. Never mind, we just got hurt anyway. Alright, don't, don't bother with the ball spewers, just, just run. Run as fast as you can. No, no, no! Oh, Crumbs. Get, get away! Don't whoop at me! Don't, don't whoop! No whooping! Help! It's whooping at me! I don't like it! Okay, I think we're good. I think we got out of there and we kept our bow. So we're in good shape! And we even got a second one, and a, and a health soda. This is the best, best time we could possibly even have. Possibly even have. Oh god, um, I don't remember what this guy... This deal is, except that he, he's kind of gross looking. I don't like how many faces he has. Oh no, my bow! I was using that to brutally own the, the enemy. No, I can't brutally own anything! My, my hits aren't even landing. He's using the power of the Super Nintendo's windowing system to shoot a laser beam at me. Help! I don't know how to program against that. I only saw a video about how that works once. It's the same effect they use for the, the spotlight in Bowser's Castle in Mario World. It's actually pretty cool. Oh! Oh, God. Okay, we got this. We can just tank a few hits. We're just gonna tank a few hits. I, 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 I hope. We'll be good. We'll be good! Oh, God. Just, just tank a few hits, we're fine! Kick him! Oh gosh, we can do this. There we go, okay. Good news everyone, we don't have to redo that level. We can just jump up and down and enjoy because we murdered that man. This is the face we make when we murder the funny clown man. Um, I, I'm gonna work on the Patreon revamp at some point soon, Pink Poodle. Uh, I, I'm, I'm still not sure what I'm gonna do with it. I haven't put a lot of thought into what kind of rewards I could give out. I'm not good at doing things. So we're the Yellow Ranger now. We're riding this platform into space. And here we are. We're in space. I don't remember what the Yellow Ranger's ability is. Okay, let's see. She doesn't have a double jump. Uh, holding down and attacking does nothing. Holding up and attacking does nothing. Guys, I think the Yellow Ranger doesn't have any special ability. That's disappointing. These guys have umbrellas, what do you think of that? Double tap to dash? Um, hold on. No, it doesn't look like that's doing anything. Huh, I guess she's just not special. Now you know, the Yellow Ranger is the least special of them all. I mean, we all we all suspected it, but now it's, it's confirmed. It's quite confirmed. Alright, we just have two more uh, Zords worth of pieces to find. I don't think we'll have any issue with that. We'll just have to beat up a few things. There we go. Oh, oh no, no, no! I don't want to fall down here. Please, no. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, we can't climb those. Those are illegal. Okay, we got it. This is the punishment zone. If you're too stupid to platform, this is where you end up. I feel... I feel sufficiently punished. And I got my fourth sword, so I think we have plenty of leeway to do what we need to do to get the last one in the final stage, so I'm not worried about it. I'm collecting this big gun to shoot the bad boys with. We did it. Doing great. Alright. Now, I don't remember them going into the sky in, in, the, in the show, but I didn't see all of Car Ranger. I saw a lot of Car Ranger, but I stopped watching at some point, and I don't remember why. Oh shit, it's this guy! Oh no! Uh, th uh, this guy in in Power Rangers, his name was Elgar, I think. He's kind of creepy looking. I, I forget his name in Car Ranger. 
I forgot what his name was in Car Ranger. Anyway, oh, oh god, we have to predict which pattern he's gonna do. I'm doing really bad. Okay, I think I've, I think I've gotten figured. Thought I had it figured out. Okay, are you gonna do a zigzag? Okay, that's good. That's good. Now I bet this is gonna be a swoop. Let's see. Swoop? Yes, I'm getting it. I'm no, 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 no. Okay, that's fine. No problem. Okay, oh, zigzag. Fine. I know how to dodge the zigzag. Okay, next one's gonna be a swoop. I think the next one's gonna be a swoop. We just have to jump. Got it. Oh, damn it. Ugh. I'm not quick enough to hit him before he's doing his nonsense. Swoop! I got ya! Zigzag! Oh, okay, we got this. It's almost like this is a baby's game for children, and I'm just really bad at it. Almost. Ooh. Oh, god. I was not expecting the swoop. Okay, zigzag. Alright, we got this. We're almost there. We're almost there. Swoop! Zigzag! Okay, we're good. We're good. I think we got the pattern down. He's dead meat, pal. Oh. What's this? What's this? Stop it! Oh, he's just dead now. I killed him forever. It's fine. He had it coming. Conehead-looking guy. But who, who's, who's throwing bombs at me? Please put those away. Is this a door? It is. I found a secret door. I found a secret door that has nothing... that has a, an engine in it. I got it. That's all I ever wanted. I'm glad I got it. Alright, so as you can see, the path is leading to their, uh, their biker... biker bar in space, where you have to go and beat them up, because they're being cruel. They're being very cruel to us, so we have to go confront them in their biker space bar. It's just what we gotta do. No, uh, uh, Shingo McDingo SD actually stands for Super Dismantled. Not many people know this, it's a common mistake that people make, but now you know. Next time you'll know. Oh shit! We got all five Zords without even having to go to the last level. That means we're well prepared to beat the game, to beat the crap out of this game. We did it. We're so smart and good. But I also have like zero health, I also have like two health I'm gonna to go to the boss, so I'm probably gonna die. I'm probably gonna die forever. Well, let's try it. Oh, it's this guy. Um, I think he... builds stuff? Oh yeah, because he's secretly... Uh, he, he, he's this other guy, see that guy who blinks in? He's that guy, but brainwashed. He's a very tragic character. With a very tragic end, and I sh should probably tragically dodge his attacks a little, a little more goodly. There we go. No, don't zoom to me. Get out of here. Okay, I can dodge those. Those tornadoes are easy to dodge. The bubbles is what I got problems with. Okay, we're good. Okay, bubbles aren't that bad. I just gotta keep my distance. Hit me with them nados. Oh yeah. You don't even stand a chance, but if you wanted to start blinking red right now, that would be great. I'd really appreciate it. I don't like that. These quarters are too close. I don't like close quarters. I like distant nickels. They're much better. There we go. Almost done. The reason he's throwing bubbles is I'm pretty sure the bad guys turn him into their janitor. So he cleans shit. And bubbles are very good for cleaning shit. Oh, oh, I'm way too close. No, back up. Back up, buddy. Alright, you're dead, meat. I, I'm pretty sure you're like one or two hits away. Yep, one hit. Got him. We did it. We freed his soul. He can ascend into heaven now. We saved him from his torment. There we go. Both of them. Oh, we got all five of them. We did it. Now we got the big boy. There he is. No one knows how he got here, but he's here. Alright, time for last stage. That means we gotta be the Red Ranger. 
Here we go. All right, we're going to their biker bar in space. A white Yoda is here because he loves the Power Rangers. So we're the Red Turbo Ranger. Uh, he he has a little little swoop to his punch. That's his power, I guess. Uh, he was originally in in the uh, in Power Rangers. He was Tommy for the first half of the season. And then when they decided to get rid of all their actors so they could hire people that they could pay less, uh, he was replaced by TJ, who eventually got demoted to Blue Ranger in Power Rangers in Space. Poor TJ. To be fair, TJ did a pretty shitty job as leader. He costed them both their Megazords and the entire command center. Good job, TJ. You're a great leader. Tommy, on the other hand, would go on to become uh, to c become a paleontologist who roundhouse kicks T-Rexes in the face, so... It it's hard to compete with that. Let's be honest. TJ had big shoes to fill. Alright, let's just keep doing flying kicks and, and punching these scorpions. We got it. Oh, please don't do that to me. Thank you. Okay, this stage is a little bullshit with its enemies. When did they get turned into kids and had to contract out the rangers to aliens? That was in the third season. That was... weird. That was pretty weird. I think it also caused Billy to start rapidly aging, because he effed up the, the cure. And then Billy ended up uh, marrying a fish alien in space. Good job, Billy. You did it. Yeah, our gas, we're, we're gonna die. We're gonna freaking die here. Oh, especially if I keep falling down to the loser bracket. Oh, no. Look, j j just end me. Wait, does that just... Where does that take me? I fell out of the loser bracket. What does that make me? I don't know where I am anymore. Oh, it just... Threw me back up here. Okay, you're good enough, but we're dead. We got birdies flying around our head. Okay, so this time we're gonna try this again, but without being a stupid idiot. We're gonna do it again without stinking so bad. This time, we're not gonna lose, because now we know all their tricks and traps where they fly in the air and shoot us with a gun, and we're gonna counteract them. Get ready, here they come. Ah, see, I knew you were coming that time. Try to shoot me with a gun, I dare you. My feet are faster than a gun, but not faster than a scorpion, apparently. It's harder to be faster than a scorpion. Scorpion is one of Mother Nature's quickest creatures. Why do you think everyone always plays a scorpion in Mortal Kombat? Because he's... <sighs> no problem. I like it down here. Actually, I like falling down. I think it's cool. I think it's real neat to be down here. I think it's a great time. I think it's real cool and nice. Oh, God, there's some kind of horrible bug in my room. Hold on, I have to murder a bug. Okay, everyone, I crushed a bug to death with, with a broken paper shredder. Are you proud of me? I did it. All right, let's kick some more things. I'm ready to kick. Oh, yeah. See, now I have a bloodlust. After murdering that bug, I just can't wait to punch this scorpion to death. It's, it's all I want now. I just want to kill more and more bugs. Oh, gosh. We missed that one. It's fine. Okay. Ah, see, 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 I knew you were there. Okay, wait, wait. There's going to be one. Hold on. Hold, hold, hold on. Okay, so this time we're not gonna fall in a hole. I did it. I'm still doing it. I'm still... I, okay, we did it. We're finally living our life. And here we are. We're in the biker bar in space. There's a funny guy on the screen and then an anime girl. And these guys are just hanging out having a drink. 
waiting for Luke Skywalker to show up and cut their hands off. And this one's even a frog. It's a great time. None of them seem to mind that we're here. They're just worried about drinking, so we'll ignore them. Here she is, the lovely anime girl who's gonna kill us with Bejeweled. Get out of here! I don't play Bejeweled. I think it stinks. I'd rather play t t t t t Columns. I don't even like Columns. I don't like Columns even a little bit. I think Columns is a terrible game. And she's dead. I killed her. Get lost. I turned her into a soda. Delicious. Alright, now we got a whole bunch of engines in case you were too stupid to collect stuff earlier. And we got all, all that we need, so let's go. Oh, back in the biker bar. Give me my sword. I got it. I'm all ready. I'm all ready to take care of business. There he is. He's the big bad guy. He's here. He was... I forget his name. I don't remember, but we're gonna kill him. I... S Oop, there goes my sword. It's fine. The foot is mightier than the sword. Oh, uh, it's not mightier than three balls, though. Be careful. Alright, all we have to do here is use the secret tactic of patience. Just patiently jump over his scoop and punch him in the poop. See, there you go. That's all you gotta do. Just learn to be patient, idiot. Just learn to be patient, you big dummy. I even punched him three times, because that's how patient I am. Ow. I think that was four times, because I'm four times as patient as the next guy. Uh, I threw him one there, because I didn't want him to think I was too patient. You don't want to give him a predictable, a predictable pattern. You gotta, you gotta remember, when you're fighting a boss in a video game, to that boss, you are also a boss, if you think about it. Whoa. Isn't that nuts? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, we're good. Okay, m maybe we're not that good. Okay, we're catching back up. Oh. Okay, I'm actually not sure how to dodge all of that at the same time, but he's blinking orange now, so we're... Okay, we're fine. Oh, no. I don't have enough... Oh, never mind, I got him. I did it. Poor guy, he's scared. Oh no! Oh, he's a big boy now! Oh no! Oh, well, what are we going to do? Oh ho ho! Oh right, we collected all the pieces to put the Megazord back together. And now he's dead. We killed him. If you don't collect all the pieces, the game ends there with the big final boss destroying the world. You get a bad ending if you don't collect all the pieces. There you go! That was Car Ranger. It's a half hour long game! <laughs> to be fair, like I said at the beginning of the stream, this, this is one of those Sufami Turbo games, which are on the little tiny cartridges that slot into the bigger Bandai cartridge, so I don't think they were sold for, you know, uh, for full price. So it's not like this was a $60 game or even a $30 game. Now having said that, I don't know how much this thing cost. I'm not Japanese. I'm not Fuyuki Nishizama. I'm not presented by Bandai. Not even a little bit. Thanks, Bandai. Thanks for nothing. And there's Yoda. He said 318. Thanks, Yoda. I appreciate it. I appreciate your numbers. Oh, he's so embarrassed. He has to be carried away now. Goodbye. Bye, you lost. Get lost, idiot. We did it. Is that the end? Can I press buttons on the controller? Okay, I pressed all the buttons, it didn't do anything. I don't know what to do with my life now. Alright, so that's Car Ranger. It's funny. And that's how it- oh! 
Oh, it does take you back to the title screen, so you don't feel completely gypped. Alright, so that's Car Ranger. But now that we've done Car Ranger, um, we still have a half hour. And let's end the Power Rangers week. The week of Power Rangers with the last Power Rangers game on the Super Nintendo that I can think of. The last one. Also by Bandai, because they have a monopoly on the Power Rangers. It's Mighty Morphin Power Rangers The Fighting Edition! Now I know I've played this on stream before, but I don't give a shit. This is the last one we got. So let's go on. Story mode. Alright guys, do you want me to play as the Thunder Megazord? Or the Mega Tiger Zord? I know it's a big choice to make. But, we're gonna have to make this choice together, because otherwise, what the heck are we doing with our lives? I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing with my life. Tiger. Thunder. Okay, it's one vote for each so far. Mega Tiger is another for Tiger. It's the Tiger. Okay, that's another one for Tiger. Another one for Thunder. Thunder. Tiger. This is really close, actually. Like, this, okay, this is way too close. I'm gonna do a quick poll. Hold on. New poll. Which Zord? Thunder Mega Zord. Or Mega Tiger Zord. And this will run for one minute. Alright, the poll is up. Click on the poll in the chat. I think that's how this works. I don't know how polls work. Click on that poll. It's up there. Um, I don't think... I think, like... I don't know how this works on mobile. I'm pretty sure it doesn't work on mobile. I'm sorry if you're on mobile. I didn't make Twitch. I didn't decide that... Uh, that my app isn't allowed to work right. So far, Mega Thunderzord is winning, but we got 30 seconds left. 30 whole seconds. Wowee. Oh, oh, mm. Got a third of the votes for Thunder Megazord, and two thirds for Mega Tiger Zord. Unless there's a big upset, it looks like we're gonna end up going with the Mega Tiger Zord. It looks like we're, we're gonna end up with the Mega Tiger Zord. Five, four, Three, two, one, and the Mega Tiger Zord one. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna be the Mega Tiger Zord. Here they come. There they are. They're all here. They threw the Red Ranger in the trash. He's not allowed to come with them today. Here we go. We're stepping on all the woodland creatures. And we even get to wear shoulder pads. Now we look professional. All right, so let's beat up the loser. The Mega Thunder Zord, Thunder Megazord is here. They use the terms interchangeably, and we're gonna f him up. Oh yeah, this is Evo, baby. Oh, I don't know his moves. <laughs> I only know the Me Thunder Megazord's moves. I probably should have played as him. Um. Okay, wait. What? What? That's not right. Okay, I thought that was one of his moves. Okay, there we go. Got one. This is the only move I figured out so far. I hope you like it. We're gonna use it a lot. <laughs> it's literally the only move I know! <laughs> oh no. I, I think I have to look up his move set. Was that a double KO? No, I won. Zordon's just back there. He's looking at us. He likes to watch. He doesn't know why this is happening. He's lost control of his life. He's just a little old man in the tube. There we go. Oops. Oh, damn, that was a... Okay, I think I figured out another one. Hold on, let's see. Got it! Oh, I would have had it if he didn't hit me like a jerk. Oh, shit! I could just throw you with one arm like some kind of asshole? Wow. I didn't know I could be that powerful. But here we are. Oh, 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 hey, baby. I like your lipstick. 
Alright, let's have a fight at the mall. I promise we won't step on anybody. I promise this is perfectly safe. It's perfectly safe to fight the titty lipstick monster at the mall. It's perfectly acceptable. No one will have an issue with it. You think this mall has a good food court? You think they have a Sabaros at both the entrance and the exit to their food court? Because that's how you know you have a really good mall. You think they have a, a, a Sakura uh, noodle noodle joint? I bet they have... I bet they have one of those Italian places where all the food has been sitting out in, in hot coolers. Hot coolers. Hot food heaters for... Uh, like four hours a day and they make the food once and then they'll put it in the fridge for the next day and you're gonna eat it You better like it Well, we destroyed them all I'm sorry everyone our lipstick waifu is dead. She exploded. She had it coming. Oh No, it's the ninja megazord. He's not invited. He's not supposed to be here. He's not in this season of the show! This is an illegal crossover. We're gonna have to kick him now. Oh, oh, he's good at- he's good at blocking. He's- he's a very good blocker. Do you like his frog butt? Do you like how his butt consists of a frog? I do. I think that's neat. God damn, he's like the block master! Oh! Okay, I guess I could just do that. I, I guess that's an ability I have. It would have been nice if I had done that on purpose. I mean, I absolutely did that on purpose. Witness my power. Why isn't this at Evo? Why isn't this at Evo? I think it's make a great Evo game. I think the Mega Tiger Zord should be in Smash. Search your feelings, you know it should be true. I'm trying to I'm trying to do what I did before. Oh, there we go, I did it! I'm still not sure how I did it, but I did it. Unfortunately, there are no Beetleborgs games I've checked. It's quite a shame. There's a VR Troopers game. It sucks. A lot. Oh, fuck. Shit, it's a Shogun Megazord. This guy's huge. Look at how big he is. One thing I like about the Shogun Megazord, and by like I mean irritates me, is you see how his left arm is blue, and then his right arm is white? That's because, um... That's because in the show, uh, that's the White Ranger Zord. They're, the Pink Ranger didn't have a, a Shogun Zord. But, when they released the toy... And uh, in stores, guess what? They colored the White Ranger sword pink. So suddenly, you have a toy with a pink arm, when in the show, it was white. And of course, the children purchasing it are gonna notice and be very upset about this, Bandai. Get your shit together. Now granted, in the show, sometimes the Pink Ranger would ride in the White Zord with the White Ranger, and she would just press buttons on the wall to make herself look useful. But still, that doesn't warrant turning the whole damn Zord pink. To make matters worse, I'm pretty sure there's uh, there's an American-only scene in the show where it combines the Shogun Zord with the Ultra Zord, and they use the toy for that shot. So suddenly, uh, the arm turns pink for, like, one shot. Look, I was, like, in elementary school when this show was, was airing. So, I noticed this kind of stuff. I was just a little baby. I, I noticed this kind of thing. You can't- you can't pull a fast one on little baby Rockhawk64. What do you think I am, a stupid idiot? I go to school and I eat a grilled cheese. I'm very smart. This is what you get for thinking you could fool me. I did it. You're right, boy, because they did release a red Ninjor, but that was, like, multiple years later. They just reused the mold for Ninjor during another completely unrelated season where Ninjor didn't appear at all. 
I don't know why they did that. No, I do know why they did that, to sell toys. Although I don't know which child would buy a toy of a character who doesn't appear in their favorite show. This is back when children still played with toys and they didn't play with, with TikToks on their, on their telephones. I'm pretty sure that's all kids do nowadays, right? They play with TikTok on their telephone. I think that's how that works. I haven't been a kid in a long time. I don't know. I don't know how this how this hat. Oh no! It's our evil twin. Oh, oh no! You know what toy I wish I had as a kid, but I didn't. The Jurassic Park. Dinosaurs with dino damage on them. You could like peel off a piece of their skin and there'd be bone and flesh back there I never had any of those. I don't know why I never had any of those. I would have liked to have had them But I didn't have them But it, it doesn't matter at the end of the day if I wanted to have a dino damage toy I could go on eBay right now and buy one, but I haven't so if I haven't bought one Maybe it wasn't that important Maybe, if it was really that important, I'd do something about it. I, 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 there we go. I'd appreciate not dying to chip damage, thank you. I also remember as a kid, the Anim- the Animorphs books were super popular. And at one point, they had a collaboration with Transformers, and they made, like, Beast Wars toys of them, where you would have the kids that could transform into the animals. But because you had, you know, action figures of, like, a boy turning into a, a, a gorilla, you had a toy that looked fine as a gorilla, but in their human form, they just looked like a gorilla wearing clothes with a tiny little boy head on them. And it was kind of ridiculous. Like, you would have a, a girl turns into a cheetah, and they look fine as a cheetah, but as a girl, they just look like a girl to have that has chunks of cheetah hanging off of them. Like, you can tell they were trying, but they just didn't have- you- they could not engineer a toy that looked correct for- for the source material. Speaking of the source material, Animorphs were really fucked up when you- Like, have you- have you- have you ever read the Animorphs? Like, they end up recruiting a bunch of disabled kids as an auxiliary uh, team and send them into battle with under you know with the idea that oh you know they they their lives kind of suck anyway if they die it won't matter like it's kind of super fucked up it's really super fucked up and that was a that was a like a that was a book series for like 7 year olds to read and you had like themes of like genocide and like Slavery of entire species going on in it. Oh, there's Goldar. No, I forgot that Goldar is the part of the game that gets hard. Eat it. Yeah, that's true. There's a kid who gets stuck as a hawk for the rest of his life. He, he like, his, his dad, his single dad suddenly doesn't have his son anymore. And it's not like this kid can just say, It's okay, Dad, I'm a hawk. No, his dad just has to assume his son is fucking dead. Jesus, the Animorphs was screwed up. I don't know if the books still hold up, because I read them as a baby. But maybe it will be worth reading it. Maybe I should reread them because they were so screwed up. Wait, Goldar can't die. This isn't canon. Not canon. Goldar does not die. Here's Lord Zed. He's here. He's buff. He has his brain sticking out. Lord Zed was the first uh, bad guy made originally for the Power Rangers. Lord Zed does not have a Japanese Super Sentai equivalent. He was never in the original Japanese shows. He was made specifically for America. 
And considering how gruesome he kind of looks, that's pretty fucked up, but they did a great job. They got enough parents complaining that Lord Zed was too scary that they ended up having to tone down his character in later episodes and make him make him less less frightening. Cause oh, I don't remember him doing like Zangief grapples in the show, but there you go. I'm pretty sure he can't do Zangief gra grapples in the show. I think that's an original creation. That the big old Chinese myth dragon behind us is Serpentera. He's Lord Zed's evil Zord. He's fucking enormous. As you can see, I'm a Megazord, and uh, Serpentera is still big. That shows you how big he is. He he was from I believe he's from. I believe the origin of him was from Die Ranger. I think yeah yeah Die Ranger because he has the Chinese theme going with him. So that that's where it came from. Uh oh, we're, we're screwed. We're not doing so hot. Oh, I winded up too long. Lord Zed got me. He kicked my grass. And now he's going to taunt me. Should I continue or end? I guess for now I'll continue. Oh, I'm so mad at you! Oh, well, let's try that again. Clearly, we have to just not be stupid. Alright, one more time with feeling. No, 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 that's not the right feeling. Use a better feeling. No, no, that's also a bad feeling to use. Oh, wow, we're doing shit. We're doing real shit. Oh, he's... He's interrupting all our attacks. This is the worst. How the... How did those all miss? Guys, we're getting fucking handled. This is bad. This is bad news. Okay, okay, that's better. That's better. I think the Mega Tigazord is like way too slow to fight this guy. I mean, obviously we can do it. It's just Zed's a much quicker character, it seems. Come on, come on, do the super! Oh man, he teleported and like negated half of the damage. Okay, good, good, good. Come on, just chip damage him to death. Come on, there we go, okay. Okay. Just, just, alright, we gotta win one more round. It's round three, we got this. Oh, damn it. Oh, you see that right behind him? He's got nothing on me. You like that? You like you? Oh, oh, no, no, please don't like it. Okay, we're doing better. We're doing better. I promise I'm not just kind of spamming him right now. Got him! Yeah! Everyone, Zed is dead. We did it. We beat the whole game. Lord Zed has died. Oh, he exploded. Oh, no! It was the Ivan Ooze all along! Oh! Who would have thought he'd be here? He's come to get revenge for us not beating Power Rangers the movie on Tuesday! He's upset that he never got to be seen! Oh, shit! You don't belong here! Get lost! No! Eat it! Get bent, Ooze! Oh, come on. It's no fair. You're not allowed to, f to fly in fighting games. You're, you're OP. You're gonna get banned at Evo. No wobbling. No Ivan Ooze. No wobble Ooze. No goose in Ooze. Don't spooze on the Ooze. All right, get ready for round two. Come on, Ooze. Come on, Ooze. You thought you could surprise me? Well, guess what? You're doing a great job. I'm very proud of you. Okay, no more surprises. Eat. Fist. 
Eat bird. Oh, wait, wait. Eat my bird a little more. Thank you. There we go. That was a good one. Is that going to hit? Of course it's not going to hit. Why would that hit? Oh, gosh. It's fine. We dashed under his ass. He doesn't have any legs in this form. No one knows where they went. He never f flew like this in the movie, but uh, uh, don't, don't worry about it. He can fly if he wants to. He can leave his friends behind. Uh oh No, don't chip damage me to death. Oh, okay, yeah, just fly up there and dodge my suit, my ultimate. That's fine. I don't mind. I'm good with that. And chip damaged. Oh, boy. It's fine. It's fine. Round three. We just gotta take about round three. Damn it! His is quicker! Alright. Oh, okay, okay, we're good. There we go. We gave him a little, a little smack. Just, just a little tap. But all it takes is a thousand taps, and uh, you can kill a man. Just with taps alone. Don't be discouraged. If you ever want to murder a man, just tap him. Ooh, you see that? He let his guard down for one second, and now he's on fire. Remember how in the Power Rangers movie, they killed Ivan Ooze by kicking him in the balls? It's a shame we don't kill him by kicking him in the balls here. More phenomenal! Go, go, Power Rangers! We did it. We did it, everyone. We're more phenomenal than anyone. Now we get to watch the credits roll. No Rita? No, they stuffed Rita into a space dumpster and threw her into space. And now as a reward for beating the game, we get to watch the intro cutscene again, interspliced with people's names. So... So Bandai made a finding game engine for this game, and afterwards they went and used this same engine for um, uh, for a for a Gundam Wing finding game on the Super Nintendo. So they got mileage out of this. Did Rita ever come back after being thrown in the trash? Yeah, he, she came back and she and she married uh, uh, she married Lord Zed. Try hard mode, and you can get a secret code. But I don't want to try hard mode. I already know the secret code. Guys, I already know the secret code. Let me see if I remember it. I, I think I have to go to fighting mode. Okay, uh... Let me see if I remember this. Uh... Can player 2 pick up the controller? No? Okay. Because if player 2 could pick up the controller, that would be great. I, J, K, L, and P. Right? P. Oh, look at that! Now I can be Ivan News if I want to be! What do you think of that? Nice secret code, idiot! Nice secret code that no one could possibly guess! And now we're gonna get revenge on our, our on ourselves. We're just gonna fly. We can do whatever we want. We're the Oozinator now. You ooze, you lose. That's what they say. This is not Evo-friendly. This goes against every rule in the books. You're gonna get... If you break this rule at Evo, you're gonna get murdered. They're gonna have, um... They're gonna have the, uh... Oh, shit. Quick, name a... Name a professional fighting game player. I'm, I'm blanking. I, I'm blanking. The Daigo, they're gonna have Daigo come out and, and parry you to death. You're gonna try to get away from him, but he's just gonna keep parrying you until you catch fire. It's really unfortunate and probably illegal, but you shouldn't have broken the evil rules. You shouldn't have. We did it. All right, so there you go. That was Power Rangers: The Fighting Game, and that was Car Ranger. So that concludes all the Power Ranger games on the Super Nintendo. Neat. Very neat. Alright, so that will do for our mini stream for the day. 
Thank you for joining me today. I appreciate you showing up. On Saturday, we're going to continue playing Banjo Tooie. We're gonna. I went ahead, uh, as you all know, we had a horrible disaster last time where we lost all our progress, but I went ahead and I replayed all the progress this very same day. I got it done in about half the time, and I bound save state to the back button, so we'll be save stating all the time so we don't lose our progress again. So on Saturday, we'll pick up where we left off in Pterodactyl Land. We're gonna get all the dinosaurs, and then we're gonna see what other horrors await us in Banjo-Tooie. It'll be great. That's gonna be on Saturday. Probably around 1 p.m. Eastern, but I'll let you know on Saturday. I'll let you know. And if I turn my, my emulator on and I see that my save is missing again, I'm gonna scream and pull my toenails out live on Twitch. I don't think that's against the terms of service. I hope it's not. It's not against the terms of service, is it? Oh no. Well, I'll 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 read I'll read over the 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 Twitch terms of service first, and then I'll pull my toenails out. It'll be fine. I'll 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 I, you know what I'll consider. What I'll consider is, if it is against the terms of service, instead, I'll just do a stream where I sleep for eight hours, and you can all watch me sleep for eight hours, and it'll be great! That seems okay with Twitch staff. They don't have a problem with that. I'm sure it'll be very popular. Alright, that's enough of that. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna wrap things up here. I have to go to work tomorrow. I have to be up at six to go to work. So, thanks for showing up. I appreciate all of you. Here is a chicken. And... Um, Mario.